So hello everyone, this is my second English motor vlog, yes, so today I'm riding with Alexi on a Gilera SMT, same sort of bike as mine, different engine, different chassis, basically the same bike to be honest, <laughs> just a little bit worse in every possible way. <laughs> Let's pass him. Uh, yeah. I don't want to seem stupid that I'm talking right next to him in English to myself. But he knows I'm more vlogging, so hopefully he doesn't mind too much at least. He most likely is now looking at me, staring right into my soul. <laughs> so yeah, I really don't have a topic. To be honest, holy shit, what the fuck? Ah, sketchy. Let's let Alex go first, because we are going to his house first, because he has some shit in his bag, so he's gonna drop them off, and then we are going to go out riding somewhere, not really sure where or why, to be honest. <laughs> uh, I don't really approve of this route, to be honest. I really don't like this road in the winter. Holy shit. Well, it's sliding all over the place. I really dislike this road because the screws at this point are really horrible. I've crashed on this road once really badly, to be honest. Surprised I didn't break anything like bones or anything else. Completely fine, although I did twist my back a little bit and my back was hurting like for two or three weeks after that, but it's okay now. It's really, to be honest, it's in my family from my father's side that almost everyone has some back aches basically all of the time. And the one thing that really made my back aches stick out was when I was on a snowmobile, my stepdad was the one driving. We hit a, a bump and I had a shovel on my back, uh, a field shovel. I don't know if you Americans know what that is, but if you've been to the army, you probably know it's It's like a shovel that you can fold fold in so it fits into a smaller space but anyways I had one of those in my back and the snowmobile hit the bump and it sent me flying in the air and then I landed on the snowmobile so the shovel hit me between uh, the things on your back you know what I mean on your spine and that really, really hurt. I, did, I couldn't feel my legs for a couple of minutes and I was really fucking scared that I got paralyzed or something. That, that's most likely the most horrible moment in my entire life, to be honest. Because that just felt so fucking horrible. I don't even remember how long that's been. Like two years, maybe? I remember I wasn't riding in the winter back then, so... And the snowmobile wasn't ours, it was rented, we were on a holiday destination. I don't remember any... I don't remember where we were, but... We were in Finland in a place where you go downhill skiing and skiing and all that kind of fun stuff, and... We had a snowmobile there and we were driving around, and... That was the first time I honestly really have been riding a snowmobile. I've tried riding a snowmobile on the ice, but riding on ice is nothing compared to riding in the woods. It's one of, it was a fun holiday after all, but that one moment wasn't really that much fun, <laughs> as you can probably imagine. <laughs> 